up, good people? Today is Two Minute Tip Tuesday. Let's get into this video. I remember on my Dodge Neon, I remember uh, I needed a coolant flush. You know what I'm saying? The coolant turned brown, but you shouldn't mix your coolant. So if you got a green coolant, stay with green. If you got a purple coolant, stay with purple. If you got a um, orange coolant, stay with orange. Because you should not mix your coolant with your uh, with the coolant that you have. So check the owner manual for your coolant or visit your local dealership to see what kind of coolant they use in the car that you drive it. Because I remember when I had a Dodge Neon, man, I used to mix my coolant all the time. I, I'd be like, man, why, why is it like this? I remember doing a coolant flush one time because my car was overheating. I was kind of mad. I was like, what in the world? Why is it overheating? But come to find out, the coolant, the two coolant that I used to use was really didn't um, combine well. And I was like, ah, oh, shoot. So I had to do a coolant flush. So I do remember doing a coolant flush on the uh, Neon. Man, for a recommended coolant flush is every 30,000 miles or 50,000 miles on your vehicle. Hold on. Just to keep your investment up to par, you should do that. You should do all the routine maintenance on your car check the owner manual or just refer back to your boy artist speed because i'm going to be reading on this manual but y'all can get the best maximizers of your car man because i know in the gen coupe i got to keep the car looking good and the car running i got to keep the car up and running because we are coming up on the summer times and you know car shows starting to start i don't know because of the COVID 19 but uh man i really do miss them car shows if you enjoyed this video go to smash that thumbs up button if you're not part of the auto speed family go to hit that subscribe button and yo welcome to the family i look forward to seeing you next video